Good morning slash afternoon slash evening everybody. I am Southpaw Racer. This is the Automobilista Australia Touring Car Championship. We're at Taruma this round, round out of the season. The chicane layout qualifying is about to begin. A couple of things before I get started though. Number one, I've actually had my weight penalty reduced. Hooray, wonderful. I now have 130 kilograms of extra weight as opposed to 145. The second is that I've moved my camera to the bottom left, so you guys get a better view of my right side virtual mirror. We'll see how everything goes. Qualifying time. Of course, I've just decided to come out of the pits way behind everybody else, so I have some clear air in front of me. So we'll see how this one turns out. This setup is a bit nervous in these high-speed turns, but we are running the chicane layout of Taruma today, so it's broken up by a little bit of slowness, maybe an outbreaking opportunity. We'll see how it goes. This is a this track is a bit draconian for track limits. Well, I probably shouldn't say draconian. It's actually quite reasonable. It's just hard to get right. <laughs> Come on, come on, work the wheel, work the wheel. Don't understeer off. Okay, good, good, good. A little bit of understeer through the first part of the chicane. But that's alright. Should have turned in a little bit earlier for that. You can break very late for this one. I figured out an acceleration point that's okay. Like that. This turn, second gear on the entry. Uh oh, <sighs> kind of messed that up. Going on the throttle a little too soon. Probably beneficial to leave it a tad. I am up though. One more turn. Ugh, didn't apex quite late enough. Oh well, that's that done. 15.8 is the time to beat currently in this first phase of the session. P1. Good stuff. Alright, well, I wasn't able to improve on that in the rest of the session, so it looks like it'll be at best a P2 start for me. Don't know if anyone else is going to improve on their times, so... We'll see, we'll see. After qualifying, I volunteered myself to do the community lap on the stream of the race, which is basically just a thing where a community member does an onboard lap and talks their way through it. They do one for every broadcast. It went pretty well. But then, just after I'd finished it, the first of my dramas struck. Oh, I've just been... Oh. I just did the community lap and I've been booted. <sighs> Internet dramas. Of course, of all times, has to happen now after I've qualified P2. Fuck, man. I wonder if they'll let me back in. I don't know how long my internet's going to take to sort itself back out here. All right. Okay, cool. False alarm, false alarm. They they um, held up the starting of the session for me, and uh, I am able to get back in. So thank you very much, guys. I appreciate it. Oh my god, that was stressful. I was almost a non-starter. Okay, let's get it on. Okay, here we go. So, once again, I go when the leader crosses the start-finish line. Green flag, green flag. Okay, don't go on green. Go when the leader crosses the... What the hell? Okay, right, well... He didn't exactly go at the start-finish line. He went slightly before, but whatever. <sighs> so, Jamie Snow has... A little bit of a gap here. Just go slightly defensive into the chicane. Don't want anyone getting the better of me into there. All right. 
right, let's see how we do it on the opening laps of this race. Me and Jamie are actually leaving the rest of the field behind. They seem to be content to battle amongst themselves for now. We'll see what happens when our tires get worn. And if we battle hard, lap one complete. Uh oh. Oh. oh dear, can't do that too much more often. I need to be careful about that. Lap one complete. Jesus. Don't know what's happened to Snow, but he's suddenly gotten a big amount of pace. Let's see how we go here. catch up to him here. But he gets me in this last section of the lap. I'm not quite sure what's going on. Oh, he just seems to be getting a better run out of that airpin. Jesus, look at him go. Wow. Uh -oh. oh, bit too much oversteer for my liking there. It's probably in my best interest to actually look after my tyres a little bit. So I have something to fight with at the end. The degradation. Over 25 minutes. What Hello. Messed up the chicane. Come on, baby. I'm ready, dude. I am in the bloody ring. Boxing gloves are on, but they can come off if need be. God, he is really locking up through that section. Problem is, I'm just not carrying the speed that he is through that part. Good. Come on, come on. A little bit more speed, please. Thank you. Jeez, from third back, they look like they're having a right old squabble. I'm really losing ground to this guy. I feel like I'm driving pretty well, but... He's just starting to pull away. Maybe he's just found something once the tires have come up to temperature that I haven't. 15 minutes remaining and I cannot catch up to him. He just seems really comfortable. He's built up the gap that he needs. Just two seconds between him and me. extract something out of this car if I want any chance of winning this. Whoop. This is not how you go about extracting pace. Oh god, the tires are starting to go. That's the sign. Just not the braking power that I had at the start. We're just over the halfway point of the race. The oh, what for? Oh, fifth place. Oh, Jesus. What the fuck? Okay. 
And that, friends, is why Teruma is not FIA Grade 1. <laughs> oh, my lord. Well, that's, uh... That moment of caution has unfortunately lost me a bit more time. And really thrown me off my rhythm. So, that's, I think, at least another second between myself and the leader. Oh, 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 oh. oh, well, the gap's out to four seconds and as we come up to six minutes to go. My tyres are gone once again. I just worked them too hard in the opening stints. The opening lap, sorry. <laughs> Wrong fucking terminology. But that's what happens when you're trying to devote all your concentration to driving a bunch of pixels. That's an approximation of a real-life race car. <sighs> oh, traffic, though. This could work out well for me. We'll see. Oh, no. He's been let by without issue. My last glimmer of hope disappearing over the horizon. Alright. One minute to go here. Whoop. Nearly nine seconds. My god. Yeah. I just I just don't have anything to go up against him. So it'll be two laps to go now. Oop, careful. No grassy grass. I'd rather not get a cut track penalty. I'd also rather not do that. I just cannot get the chicane down anymore. Damn, it's like it's like once once you get past like the halfway point of the race, these brakes just stop working. And it's so frustrating. But, you know, I don't have much left to pursue him with, and I'm safe for seconds, so what's the point of taking any risks? Might as well just drive this thing home. So the time has run out. That means next lap will be the final lap. Oopsie. A little wide. Come on, come on. Get back on there. Thank you. You know what? It's definitely September here in Australia because the weather is starting to warm up. And I'm properly sweating for the first time in a few months. Oh, Jesus, I don't want to go, I don't want to do that. My head's running away with me. Come on, no risks, no risks. Oh, come on. Bastard. <laughs> that chicane is going to be the death of me. I can feel it. Either way. Ah, oh, come on. It's just that that entry phase of the corner as you start approaching the mid corner that's that's where the the front end is really struggling on exit it's like you know whatever you can just mash the throttle and you'll be fine whatever though <sighs> snow's already won that's him crossing the line just up ahead on the map I'll come home to take second. Well, for my first podium in this series, that was damn boring from, from an entertainment perspective. But nonetheless, I'll take it. Second place. Time for the reverse grid. I'll be starting uh, second last out of the people that finished the race. We'll see how that one goes. As it turns out, it didn't go at all. I didn't leave the server in between the sessions, I didn't do anything. But when we were gridding for the second race, my wheel and pedals decided to chuck a hissy fit. Oh, 
fucking hell. Why? Why? Controls. What the fuck? Why are- I don't have any of my controls! My controls aren't working! What?! What the fuck? My pedals are not working. Shit! Fuck! Oh, come on! No, oh, it's just too late. I'm, I'm, I'm pressing my brake pedal. <sighs> yeah. Okay. So the keyboard works, but but my fucking controller doesn't. Great. Fucking great. What on earth happened? Piece of shit. This has happened quite a bit with Automobilista recently, having to remap my controls and stuff, but it's never done this to me. I've never just flat out lost all control in between race sessions. Like, it's plugged in. My wheel is fucking plugged in. My pedals are too. I, I use separate wheel and pedals. This is crap. Oh well. Looks to me like my night is over. So, a boring first race with second place is, is all I have to show for myself tonight. <sighs> Pretty terrible YouTube content, actually. I apologize if this wasn't as entertaining as it could have been. But, <sighs> shit happens sometimes, I guess. Either way, have a good one, guys. I'm Southpaw Racer. I'm a sim racer. I make videos about that and other stuff. I will see you, hopefully, at the first corner with a wheel and pedals that, that decide to work all of a sudden. Subscribe for more uh, political commentary vlogs.